how often do you go to a website and, and you actually like the product or service that's being offered there and you're looking around, but you purposely don't fill out the contact us form. Why? Because you don't want to be hassled by a salesperson. You don't want to be called. You don't want to be emailed. I guarantee you that happens all the time. It happens to everybody. Hey, it's Jay Bear with another Jay Today, where I give you a piece of my mind three minutes at a time. Today, I am in Deer Valley, Park City, Utah, the fantastic uh, St. Regis uh, doing a speaking engagement. It's awesome out here, just fantastically beautiful. And I was given a speech just a few moments ago, and one of the things that really resonated with this audience is that exact point, that today, more than ever before, relationships are created with information first and with people second. And that's exactly opposite of how it's been for the balance of of human history. It used to be back in the day, you would call a business or typically just go see a business, just walk into their front door and say, hey, what do you got here? I mean, there's a whole category of, of behavior that we call window shopping. Well, window shopping still exists, but it's mostly online now. Where you go to a website, you read a web page, you watch a video, you look at a white paper, you read another web page, you look at a photo gallery, you look at customer reviews, you self educate. And then, and only then, when you've self educated, if you're still interested after doing that, will you fill out a contact us form? Will you use the phone number? Will you actually communicate with a human being in a synchronous capacity? Because you know, having synchronous conversations is a hassle. I have to be talking the same time you're talking. It's much easier to leave you a message and get a message back, whether that's email, text, something else. So if you think that you have enough information on your website, I'm here to tell you, you probably don't. You probably don't have enough information to fully create that relationship. If somebody has to call you in order to buy from you, you're probably doing it wrong. Today's Sprout Social shout outs from my friend Joe Palizzi, uh, the head of the Content and Marketing Institute, and some call him the godfather of content marketing. Just got back from Content Marketing World, the big conference in Cleveland uh, yesterday, had a terrific time, an excellent show. Joe and his team did a bang up job as always. If you're not following Joe in social media, you absolutely need to do that. Pick up his book, Epic Content Marketing as well. It is fantastic. This show, Jay Today, is brought to you by the good people at Sprout Social, uh, social media marketing and management software. It's what I use for my own social media. Also, the show is brought to you by Candidio, a very easy video editing service. They help me with these uh, shows. I just upload this from my iPhone to Candidio. They do the rest. They make it uh, look pretty for you. Until tomorrow, I am Jay Bear. This has been Jay Today. Make sure you subscribe. Uh, YouTube, iTunes, Stitcher, whatever is your pleasure, do that so you don't miss an episode. See you later. Cheers. Hey, I'm Jay Bear. I want to introduce you to my brand new show, Jay Today, where I will be talking about social media and business on an almost daily basis. Real quick videos, very easy, snackable, bite size, as they say. You can get it on YouTube. You can get it on iTunes. You can get it on Stitcher. You can get some great ideas right here. Want to subscribe? I think you do. All you got to do is click one of these buttons. Thanks so much. I'll see you tomorrow.